Hi, my name is Jason Stanford, former Major League pitcher with the Cleveland Indians and current owner of the Strikeout Strips. It's a throwing aid device for young amateur baseball players as well as professional baseball players. And what this product does is it teaches you how to repeat your delivery over and over again. What we're going to go through today is I'm going to teach you the three steps of what we do with our 12-week program that allow you to learn how to repeat your delivery. We'll learn to not only repeat it, but also be able to develop some velocity and some power behind that as you continue through your process. First phase that we're going to talk about is you always want to get in a set position, or we call it the prayer position. Prayer position looks just like this. It's your set position. Once you get into this set position, you should be ready to go. When we do this, we rock forward, we rock back to start the device, to start our motion, to allow us to be consistent with our delivery. Now, I don't ex expect you guys to do this when you are actually pitching in a game, but it allows you to teach yourself how to repeat your delivery over and over again. The first step that we go is all we do is we rotate our backside, and we're not going to follow through just yet, but you're going to watch the glove side be consistent every time. And what I mean by that is we get our thumb out, extended through. Once we get our glove extended through, our back arm should be right in line with that with the strips dangling. And when you pull through and rotate, we should be right in here, and then you would follow through. So here I'm going to demonstrate it for you right now. We get in our prayer position. We rock forward, we rock back, straight through. Okay. You want to make sure you control it all the way through. And the idea behind it is to be able to have the strips as a lefty, come over my front side and finish over my left shoulder. If I know that I'm in a good arm position, I get my arm out here and I follow through, it should repeat its delivery over and over again coming over my shoulder. I get here, I rock forward, I rock back, I come through, coming right out through. We'll do it one more time. Hands are together, prayer position, I rock forward, I rock back, step and go. And we're right in position right here. And you can see I'm in a good power position. My hands have come through. I've extended over to my right side. And as you can see, the strips have followed through right on my left shoulder. Exactly what you want. The next set that we do, the next 10, you're going to come through. You're going to power through. Backside's going to roll over and then pick up. And you're going to finish through. We go back to our prayer position. We rock forward. We break through. We come through. And then we're up. As you can see, I'm powering through. The strips are coming over. We'll do it one more time. Prayer position. Rock forward, rock back, straight through, and through. And you want to make sure you're rolling over that back side, powering that back hip to your target. Rock forward, rock back, coming through, and that was perfect right there, right how you want to be. Last set that we do, the last 10 that we do, is we accelerate through with our back hip. We really want to have that back hip explosion along with our back shoulder, elbow coming through at the same time, making sure that everything is going right to your target, and this is what it looks like. Prayer position. We rock forward, we rock back, coming through all the way out. As you can see, my whole motion going right towards my target. Rock forward, rock back, coming through and out. Every time, my strips should be hitting me right on my left shoulder like they are right now. As we finish up, remember, you always start prayer position. You're going to rock forward, you're going to rock back, coming through and hitting out. And as you can see, I accelerated through a little bit more. The strips came over, and they actually wrapped around a little bit more. You always want to make sure you get extension, you pull through, you try to get over on your, opposite, on your glove side, so for me as a lefty, I'm trying to get over to my right hip. If you're a right-hander, you try to get over to your left hip. Coming through, having these come over your, your shoulder, you should finish up in a power position. If you want to learn more about this, go to learntopitch.com. The product name is Strikeout Strips. And I hope to see you guys soon. Thank you.